What's up, fam? Welcome back to my channel. It's a vibe with your girl Monica. Yes, it's finally here. The Sims 4 Discover University. Finally, right? <laughs> okay, guys, today this gameplay is just going to be about my Sim family, the triplets. And we're going to watch the mom as she, you know, first tell her kids that she want to go back to school and um, deciding which school to go to and, of course, how she's going to pay for it. Okay, guys, so um, I don't have anything to drink right now. I don't have no snacks. It's in the middle of the day. Only thing I'm trying to do right now is jump into this gameplay. All right, guys, let's get started. Welcome to the Sims 4 Discover University. I can't believe I'm saying that right now. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, well, first, if fam, if you've seen any of my past videos, you know, you know your girl. I ain't trying to read all this, right? So you guys can pause it while I skim through this, all right? Settle into school, class with class, meet, mingle, and explore, express your campus style. I'm, I can't believe we actually got this game. This, I, I've seen some YouTubers play some of it, and it seemed like it's been uh, very positive so far. I just hope I can have that same experience. And just by looking at these pictures, it really seemed like, you know, it should be very, you know, in-depth, I hope. All right, I'm going to do a little overview of this um, University of Town, Brightchester. You guys can read the royal description. Pause the video if you want to while I skim through it real quick. Royal description. Begin a new chapter in the historical University of Brightchester or Martin Foxbury Institute. That, I think it's cool that they got two universities, you know, one modern, one technical. Laurel Library, Foxbury Institute. You guys can read that, Foxbury Institute and Senior compared to the historical town surrounding it. Okay, but it has quick distinguished itself as in academia. Oh, I, I can't even, I'm so excited. I just want to just pass all this stuff and just jump right in. Okay, Larry's Lagoon, Foxbury Commons, Title Tower, Fletcher, okay. Remember you in the um, trailer, Manor, okay. Gibbs Hall, Gibbs Hall, okay, Gibbs Hall, <laughs> okay, Mouse, Snelso. Okay, my mouse acting crazy. <laughs> Great call. Dip Hardy Den University of Rochester. Well known for enthusiasm of learning and humorous and large books. Oh, that's funny. I, I hold on, I just love this beat right now. This beat is a whole vibe, man. I'm about to start dancing in a minute. Dark Wing House. Dark Wing. Best of Friends. Okay. Darby's Den and Drake Hall. All right. Let's see what else do we have here. Um, Gibbs Hall. I think I already. I already. Um, through this one you guys I clicked on this one already but just in case if I didn't you guys can read it again <laughs> Royal Library I'm gonna have my Sims Pepper's Pub I'm gonna have my Sims go to that honeydew fields go to that library all the time and it's two residential homes Pleasance, Elderberry. Oh, Pleasance. Oh my God. If you guys know anything about the Pleasance and the Sims 2, which was my favorite Sims game, the Pleasance, Lilith and um, Angela, I love playing with them. It's twins, but separate. You know, they're two different twins. I, I had Angela as like the goody goody, and Lilith was like the badass. And I, I enjoyed playing with Lilith. Lilith, Lilith was my favorite to play with, actually. 
con- and I had her and Dirk um, get married and um, have kids. They had like six kids, and Lilith had her own like clothing store, and she was an artist. So that was a good time playing with the pleasants and the, and the, their parents. Oh my god! I had the dad; he was uh, having an affair with the maid, <laughs> and you know it was just a whole mess. It was fun to play though; it really was. I, I miss playing The Sims, The Sims too. Okay, the Pleasants. Angela and Lilith Pleasant has moved into an old family home. An old family home? Hmm. I wonder how old the family home is and who owned it. That's interesting. I'll let you, fam, I'll let you read that while I have it on screen for a minute while I skim through it. It looked pretty good too in The Sims 4 and the Elderberry family. Okay, this is my Sam family, the triplets. You probably already um, recognize this family from the, um, you know, the gallery that's inside the game. I got this home off of the um, Sam gallery. I have a link for it in the description if you guys are interested in um, getting it. And I actually added on to the back of the house so um, the two kids can have their own room. Because at first it was just one room. I'll give a little tour of the house and excuse me um <laughs> my mouse is really sensitive and it like it goes all over the screen all the time so if you notice that just just excuse me I don't know how to uh, what how to what controls to make the mouse you know not be so sensitive all right this is the kitchen Cute little small kitchen. This is mom's room right here. If I... Yes, this is mom's room. Hazel. And this is a picture with her and her boyfriend. This is her daughter's room right here. And her son room is over there on the other side. Her son room is right here. This is the backyard. Small backyard. But nice. They live in Oasis Springs. Okay, this is Hazel Triplets. I'm thinking about, I might give her a makeover too, because I'm not really feeling like what she has on, but I might just give her a makeover. She's a young adult, but she's going to go back to school. She's been working a part time job for so long. I think it's time for her to just to go to go back to school and discover something new. Her aspiration is grilled cheese, career, chef, stalker, retail career. $33 an hour. These are some of her skills. She has a maxed out tan and fitness. Yeah, she don't have a lot of skills, you know. These are some of her relationships, her friends, her boyfriend right here, Ashley, Ashley Henry. Her friend, Monica, which is my sim self. Zoe and Ariana and Breon. Her public image, she got a good reputation. She's staying out of the spotlight. Traits, clumsy, lazy, as is a flavor music lover. I might change that lazy because I don't, I don't like that she's lazy. Okay, this is her daughter, Belinda Triplett. She, she has a master actress aspiration. Her career is a high school student with a C. She's not doing too good. She's not going off to college anytime soon. Got to get that grade up ASAP. I actually had her go off to um, Deso Valley, but I realized I wasn't able to let her be an um, a actress, so she had to come back home. She in the drama club, practical performer, and she's doing pretty good. She really want to be an actress. These are some of her skills. She, she got a six in acting, the rest of her skills. So if I do have her go off to school, these are her friends, Tyron, Brian, Tiffany. She got a good group of friends. If I do have a, her go off to school, I re- she really want to be an actress, so that's where she's going to go off to. That's her boyfriend, 
Vance Jr., my McKnight, another Sim family that I made, that I do have on my Sim gallery, Santisha 29. Public image, pristine reputation. She's almost perfect. <laughs> Notable newcomer, as far as her celebrity goes. No, some of her um, good responsibility. Traits, outgoing, user, foodie, and she's loud. <laughs> okay, so let's go to her brother, Minx Triplets. Musical genius aspiration. I might change that aspiration. Career. He's also a high school student with a C, which you need to get that up. He's a C with some of his skills. Not not doing too pretty good with his skills. Got to work on that. This is his girlfriend, Brienne. Girlfriend. He don't know anything about it, but they're soulmates. And she has a key to their house. So, I don't know. His best friend, Raphael. He don't have a lot of friends. He got a good reputation. He's a public image. Character values. Doing pretty good with it, with his character values. Traits. Perfectionist. Love outdoors. Okay, she's telling her kids she's going off to school and they're they're happy for her, so that's a good thing. They, they want their mom to do better. And this is her just talking to her boyfriend about it. Okay, this pops up knowing your scholarships. Okay. Um, distinguished scholarships, skill scholarships, need based scholarships, career scholarships. Okay, guys, I'm just gonna skim through this. And I would love for you guys to just to pause it in three, three, two. Okay. Since it has been accepted into distinguished degrees, skill scholarships, career scholarships. Universities want to encourage younger students that may already be dipping their toes in the job market. Okay. You sound pretty good. Sports and esports scholarships, resident grant. I know she's going to get a resident grant. These, there are a few scholarships that require Sam to participate. Okay. I, I think I know which scholarship I'm gonna allow her to um, apply for. They're celebrating her going off to school, so her boyfriend's like, I know, I know what we can do to celebrate. <laughs> she's like, um, okay. <laughs> Let's get them a little privacy. A little privacy. Okay. Yes. Let's, let's look at the butterflies <laughs> while they celebrate. <laughs> yep. Look at the look at the butterflies. The one-dimensional butterflies. They still celebrating. Okay. Okay, now she's just going off to the library to apply. And just get some more information on which university she want to go to and scholarships. Since she don't have a computer at her house, she went to the library to um, get some information about Fosbury Institute first. Fosbury Institute. Um, they got good, good information on these schools, organizations, degrees, distinguished degrees who have emerged as innovative leaders in their respective fields. That sounds pretty good. Art history, communication, culinary arts, organizations. Okay. The debate guild, distinguished degrees, culinary arts. Okay, they, they look pretty good. Okay, let's look at the other university now. Email form or guidance counselor. Oh, that's a good option. Let's let's email our guidance counselor and see what they have to say. I think that's a good option to have, especially with young adults and adult sims. Kind of can give us an info on like what what we should look for. 
while applying for school. Hazel has the best chance of earning these scholarships. Athletics, Alley Cat, and Esports. Okay. 450, 400. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and apply for a scholarship. Oh, it's a Springs oh. resident. That's the one I wanted to get. Just to see how, how this works, actually. Okay, she's applying for a scholarship. Okay, so that's a good start to the game. Um, apply to, no, I don't want to apply to universities right now. Okay, so okay, so that's a, that's a good start to the game. I'm gonna leave it right here. All right, fam, I'm gonna leave it right here. Thanks again for watching my gameplay. We didn't do too much in this first gameplay, but in the second episode, we're gonna have more things to show off. And um, thanks to everyone that's watching. Thanks for everyone that has watched my last. Um, gameplays i appreciate it if you like the content like subscribe hit the notification bell so you always know when i'm posting leave comments and i just appreciate everyone for um, watching my gameplays all right so i'm gonna leave it right here and i'll see you guys in the next one peace